the birth of everything, how the universe began. Imagine everything you see, the stars above, the ground beneath, the air you breathe once packed into a space smaller than a grain of sand. How could all of existence fit into something so small? Today, we journey back over 13.8 billion years to witness the birth of the universe itself. Before the beginning, there was nothing. No stars, no galaxies, no planets, no space, not even time itself. A silent void, where not even darkness existed because darkness needs space to exist in. And then something unimaginable happened. In a moment scientists called the Big Bang, the tiny hot, dense point known as a singularity suddenly expanded. It wasn't an explosion in space, it was the creation of space itself. Time began ticking, matter began forming, energy burst forth in every direction. In the first trillionth of a second, the universe was unimaginably hot billions of degrees. The fundamental forces of nature, gravity, electromagnetism, and the forces that hold atoms together took shape. For hundreds of thousands of years, the universe was a swirling sea of particles, too hot and dense for light to travel freely. But as it cooled, atoms formed and suddenly, light was set free racing across the newborn cosmos. This ancient light still exists today as a faint glow called the cosmic microwave background the universe's baby picture. Gravity began pulling matter together forming giant clouds of gas. Inside these clouds, the first stars were born. They burned brighter and hotter than our sun giants that lived fast and died young, exploding in violent supernovae. These explosions scattered heavier elements like carbon, oxygen, and iron into space. Out of these elements, new stars formed, surrounded by swirling disks of rock and gas, and from these disks, planets took shape. Billions of years later, on a small rocky planet orbiting an ordinary star in the Milky Way, life emerged. That planet is Earth, and the atoms in your body, the carbon in your skin, the iron in your blood, the calcium in your bones were forged in the hearts of ancient stars. We are, quite literally, made of stardust. So, when you look up at the night sky, remember you are not just looking at stars. You are looking at the story of everything the universe's past, your own origin, and perhaps the beginning of something even greater. Because the universe is still expanding and its story is far from over, 